Secretary of State Mike Pompeo is en route to North Korea. Korea. Pompeo himself says the focus of the trip is to plan the upcoming summit between President Trump and North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. Now, the date and location have not been announced, but the president says the meeting is set. Another issue on tap, three American detainees who Pompeo hopes he can get released. President Trump's former national security advisor says he'd like to see more veterans get involved in the political process in the United States. Michael Flynn, who cited a family emergency for canceling Sunday's rally here in Billings for GOP Senate hopeful Troy Downing, was a guest this morning on Montana Talk's radio program. They basically bring a fiber and a strength to our country that is missing and has been missing for some time. And the more we can, ha the more veterans we can have in our uh, that can operate in the sort of the political body of our country, I think the stronger our country will will continue to be. During that interview today, Michael Flynn declined to discuss his current legal case in which he pleaded guilty for lying to the FBI about his contacts with the Russian ambassador during the Trump presidential transition. Flynn did, however, take the opportunity to criticize Montana Democratic Senator John Tester for Tester's role in derailing the nomination of Admiral Ronnie Jackson as Secretary of the Veterans Administration. Flynn did acknowledge he's never met Senator Tester but said, by going public with rumors about Admiral Jackson's on-the-job behavior, it's indicative of the type of person the tester is.